Hey there YouTube viewers, today I'm going to be uh, teaching you how to read and write binary code. I remember when I was trying to learn binary code, it was very difficult to learn it because there were hardly any videos, there were no videos actually, uh, and all across the web there were only a few sites that discussed it and most of them didn't discuss it well enough, that it just had like questions, they didn't really have any answers around it. So. Uh, but I finally managed my managed my way and I learned it so now I'm just creating a video to make it a little bit easier for everyone who everyone else who wants to learn it so anyways here here it goes this is what you're gonna wanna learn first or memorize write it down if you have to you're gonna write down this list it goes from 65 to 90 and then 97 to 122 uh, then so 65 equals capital A, 66 equals capital B, 67 equals capital C, and so on. Just 65 to 90 is all capital letters. And then when you move on to 97 to 102, 122, it's all lowercase let letters. So again, just write this list down or memorize it. Uh, also with this, uh, memorize this or write it down. Uh, don't worry about the line. That's just to separate it, separate numbers. So, because I'll be teaching you. Anyways, just remember: one twenty-eight, sixty-four, thirty-two, sixteen, eight, four, two, one. All right. So these are the two things I you should know. Anyways, on to on to writing binary code. Uh, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to first pick a letter, any letter. Uh, for this case, I'm just gonna pick. Uh, I'll pick E. Why not? So you're look, you're gonna look at capital E, and capital E equals 69. So you're gonna go down here, and you're gonna look at 128. Now, how many times does 128 go into 69? It doesn't go into 69 at all. So you're gonna put a zero, and then you're gonna move on to 64. How many times does 64 go into 69? It goes into it once. So you're gonna put it there. So uh, now you're going to go 69 minus 64, which leaves you with 5. 5 left. So now you're going to move on to 32. How many times does 32 go into 5? It doesn't go into 5 at all. So, and then you just keep going down. 16 goes into 5 zero times. 8 goes into 5 zero times. 4 goes into 5 once. 2 goes into 1. Or sorry, uh, 5 minus 4 equals 1. So 2 goes into 1 zero times and one goes into one once. So that's the binary code for the letter capital E. 01000101. Uh, let's do another example here. Oh, by the way, if you're not very good with math, I suggest you have a handy dandy calculator with you. It makes things a lot easier and faster. Uh, anyways, I'm gonna pick another letter here just to show you guys. I'm gonna pick the uh, letter small k, lowercase k. So how many times does 128 go into 107? It goes into 0 times. 64 goes into it once, so 107 minus 64 equals 43. So you got 43 remainder. Uh, 32 goes into 43 once, so you're going to minus 32. You got 11 remaining. 16 goes into it zero times, 8 goes into it once, so minus 8. Hopefully by this time you should be able to minus it by yourself, but if not, tough luck. Uh, three, 4 goes into 3 zero times, 2 goes into 3 once, remaining 1, and then 1 goes into 1 once. Uh, a little trick that I learned is that if you screw up anywhere through this, uh, you will not get an. E you won't. You'll have a remaining number after this number. So, for example, here, say I were to screw up like for f equals 70, and I were to put a one here. I don't know why. Maybe maybe some retarded kid decided to do that. But and you go through here zero. Oh, whoopsies. Zero 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 and you got like a minus number or an extra number then you know you screwed up 
anyways that's my tutorial for how to read binary code and writing all you have to do is reverse engineer that you're just gonna go backwards you're gonna, so you're gonna look at the binary code you're gonna see the zero for example this E hold on uh, capital letter E you're gonna go so one times one is one uh, you're gonna go four 16 or and 64 64 plus 4 plus 1 64 68 69 so basically mm. wherever you see a 1 just add the number so you see a 1 here see a 1 here and you see a 1 here 64 plus 4 plus 1 all equals 69 you just look on your chart 69 equals e and there you have it hopefully that this tutorial helped you guys a bit whoever wanted to learn this and if you want me to make a remake of it, maybe go a little more in depth, I can. Just post comment. Anyways, see you guys around.